Hey everyone, I hope you guys are doing well. It's Andrew Cartwright here and I'm in Portland, Oregon getting ready to go to Salem because I got an Ironman on Sunday that I'm doing. So I hope you guys are having a fabulous Friday. Find out which state just got approved for 159 million in federal stimulus money. Which state just approved another massive stimulus and how another state is spending their brand new stimulus package. Very interesting how they're doing it. How American citizens themselves are spending their latest stimulus check and why 900,000 people who have already received their stimulus checks are getting a bit more coming their way. Here's your daily stimulus check, second stimulus check, third stimulus check, fourth stimulus check for a lot of people, especially the ones getting it now. Um, executive order and stimulus package update for Friday, July 23rd, 2021. My goal always is to dig up treasure hunt the greatest stuff the latest stuff for government and private money for yourself your loved ones and your family being that i have 12 different banking programs in my description with 75 banking partners try and help you guys out the best way i can to put out personal videos about credit stock market real estate crypto and other investments to help you generate income and save you loads of money so if you wouldn't mind subscribe like and comment when you subscribe, you're entered to win. We're giving away $1,900. Hopefully it'll be this weekend. Um, all you have to do is um, comment. We're gonna pick a random comment and we're gonna launch out 1,900 bucks. So subscribe, like, and comment. But first, one state was recently approved for a whopping 157 million in stimulus money. Where is that money going? You gotta ask yourself. To 30, 360 Kentucky cities um, the purpose is to offset revenue losses brought on by the virus. Kentucky Governor Andy Bashir, we've talked about him, said, I'm relieved our eligible city governments will receive these funds because if we are building back better Kentucky, we will ensure the communities are supported and positioned for growth. Well, a full list of cities receiving the stimulus money and how much they're getting for the first payment will be posted in the description below. So hopefully it's in your neck of the woods. That's right, they're getting the money with half of it coming now and the rest of it coming sometime next year. So we've still got more stimulus as things shake out. Next up, we got another state approved for a pretty large chunk of dough that will be Georgia. With a recent, they got $230 million in stimulus. So a big thank you to the teachers and staff. Another one is coming in. A reminder that their stimulus funds just were approved, a whopping $1.4 billion, which is going to support K through 12th grade through, throughout the state. The state that's giving $4.2 billion, which they got $2.8 billion already back in March. The rest of us are being distributed through the state's educational system, allocated based on specific fund formulas required by federal law rules. The goal is to expand after school programs and fund summer school programs that so many people are struggling with what to do with their kids right now. State School Superintendent Richard Woods, quote, we are focused on supporting learning, expanding resources for student mental health and well-being and ensure that safety for students, staff members, and families, end quote. So we're seeing Georgia step up and their stimulus money and prioritizing the children and teachers in that state. That's what I like to see. <coughs> children and teachers, people taking care of one another and what better way than to help them. They're always underpaid anyway, right? Another state just got a new stimulus though approved and that would be Iowa. Lots of stuff happening today. As we saw with Georgia and Iowa is putting an emphasis on education as well, distributing the remainder of their elementary and secondary schools with the relief fund a $258 million sum, and their plan was just approved. Iowa is trying to make schools safer, more accessible to, ch to kids who will be affected by the virus. That means, again, that schools, after-school programs, and parents will be supported. U.S. Treasury Secretary of Education Miguel Cardano said, it is heartening to see, reflecting that the state plans, the ways in which states are thinking deeply about how to use the American Rescue Plan funds to continue providing critical support to schools and communities, end quote. 
Mikkel is calling this an, quote, unprecedented infusion of federal resources, end quote, that really focus on, focuses on the most urgent needs of children. Think about it. When's the last time schools ever had money, right? Kind of crazy. So we're seeing a lot of states, <coughs> excuse me, that are allocating these stimulus funds to their children's education, well-being for teachers, and how are American citizens themselves spending this money? You got to be asking yourself, well, we dug it up, our personal checks, we figured out, according to um, Claudia Sham of the uh, Family Institute, her most recent research, as much as 45% of Americans are using their money to chip away at their debt, credit cards, rent, mortgage, and overdue bills. So we're being responsible. 31% are putting their stimulus funds towards savings, and 12% are planning on spending their money on something else. Maybe an Iron Man, right? Salem said her research showed that stimulus checks, including the most recent round of the $1,400 payments under the American Rescue Plan, the quote, the American Rescue Plan, provided much needed relief to millions of families and help bolster the economy at a critical juncture in the recovery, end quote. Selim, she, uh, her research goes against ter the terrible idea <coughs> that people are frivolously spending the money, investing on stupid shorts on Robin Hood or something else. We get a bad rap, us Americans, right? So very smart. People are using their money to help out. I mean, it sounds like people have gotten a little bit of financial education, right? Maybe they're watching some YouTube. Uh, and responsible and saving. <coughs> we love to see people saving up and uh, paying off their debts because of st the stimulus is all about. Finally, for those who have received a stimulus payment, you may have more coming your way. The IRS shifted. <coughs> Sorry, there's so much smoke out here with all the smog. Money for that probably didn't know you were owed because, well, you didn't get paid enough. So they're making up for it. A lot are probably getting, if you filed your taxes for April and May, after the checks were already sent, that means the amount might not totally be accurate with the IRS, and they could be sending you another one. They're calling these payments plus up again. So if you filed a tax return and they're finally getting them processed because you know they were backlogged, well, you could be getting it now. That's your stimulus check, second stimulus check, third stimulus check from Portland, Oregon, two days away from an Ironman. Um, I know some of you guys don't care that I'm doing the Ironman, but uh, I train pretty hard for this three hours a day, swimming a mile every day, running, all that stuff. So anyway, July 21st, 2021, thank you so much for watching. Please leave a comment. Tell me what you preferred. Do you prefer an iPhone or an Android? I'd love to know. I'm using an iPhone. I'm Andrew Cartwright. Please stay safe out there. Take care. I love you.